Almost done, Manny. You won't, you look, you won't. <laughs> This morning we are making Belgian waffles and I found a true, it says true Belgian waffle recipe and it called for putting in egg whites that were whipped until stiff peaks formed. So that's what we did. I'll have the full recipe down below for y'all. Once I get these going, I'm just going to make some sausage and get some different fruits set out. I'm going to make some of these with chocolate chips, but I'm going to wait until the end to add the chocolate chips. All right. Not sure how much I need to put in because I feel like these are gonna get very fluffy. We'll just start with that much on this on these. See how it goes. I'm supposed to be able to get about 10 of these out of this recipe. Tyler requested that I actually make the sausage patties instead of using the frozen ones. They like the frozen ones. They really like if I just make them from sausage like this. So that's what I'm gonna do this morning. Uh oh, it says this one's ready already. We're ready. Okay, so that was definitely enough of the mix, y'all, because I ran out a little bit on the side over here. About two ice cream scoops is how much it is. Oh, yes, they're nice and crispy. I smushed that one a little bit. Don't look at that one. <laughs> okay, well, that one just went ahead and came apart for me there. That's why. All right, so now let me add the chocolate chips for the other ones. y'all everybody's eating and loving the waffles they are really crispy so if you like crispy waffles you will love that recipe they are super crispy Titus really really like I like more of a soft waffle than crispy I like soft and fluffy but Titus likes crispy and I think the kids are liking crispy better so well it could be just that they have the chocolate chips in them <laughs> all right y'all we got the kitchen cleaned up and Titus said he needs to run to Lowe's to get a few more boards so we're gonna go with him because there's a Dollar Tree in that town and one of y'all just told me a few days ago that they have the Dollar Tree plus stuff in there now and I've never been to a Dollar Tree that has the Dollar Tree plus stuff it's like I think three and five dollar <laughs> say excuse me <laughs> I think they have like $3 and $5 items. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. So we're going to go check it out, see what they've got. And I think I'm going to run into Bell's Outlet while we're there too. Also, that town is getting a TJ Maxx and I'm very excited about that. It's not very far from here where the Lowe's is, just about 20 minutes. I'm excited about that TJ Maxx. <laughs> We are starting out at Bell's Outlet. If you've never been to a Bell's Outlet, I know they're starting to open a lot more of them around, so hopefully you'll be getting one near you soon. They kind of remind me of just a smaller version of Marshalls or TJ Maxx. They're just, you know, smaller. <laughs> But they have the same kind of stuff. Like a lot of this stuff, you know, looks like stuff you would see at Marshall's or TJ Maxx, and it is super cute. Those little carrot placemats, that was adorable. And it would look so cute with all that stuff. Oh my goodness, adorable. And I'm noticing this year for a lot of the spring Easter stuff, there's a lot of like 
old fashioned looking Peter Rabbit style decorations. That's what it looks like is going on this year. It's really cute, really pretty. Light colors, just super cute. How many times have I said cute already? I'll try to stop y'all, I promise I'll try to stop. Oh, and I saw this spin mop. It's like, I don't know if it's pink or blue. It had a pink one on the box and a blue one on the box, but if you love pink, they might have pink ones. I don't know. There we have more Peter Rabbit looking things going on. And then I think a bunny with a palm tree. I didn't even notice that when I was in the store. I just saw it now and that was something. But anyway, this pillow, I almost got that pillow, that pink pillow right there. It was like, it felt like a feather pillow almost. I don't know what was inside of it, but it felt like really really soft but I passed on it but it was really um, adorable I almost said cute again now we're going to the Dollar Tree and here's the Dollar Tree plus section in this Dollar Tree I think there were only maybe one full aisle of the Dollar Tree plus stuff it might have been two I can't remember for sure but so it was three or five dollar things they had some little throw blankets just kind of like more Dollar General Type stuff lots of cute Easter stuff this was still the Dollar Tree plus stuff those little baskets were five dollars they have towels lots of different welcome mats and I saw these uh, dry erase boards this is a really good deal I'll show them to you in a second oh wait first of all let's talk about this hello summer sign it was only five dollars and it's pretty big that's a good deal to me for five dollars these pans are also a good deal three dollars for the cake ones and five dollars uh, for the big nine by 13 cake ones and they had glass casserole dishes for five dollars now we're at the dry erase boards that is a good deal that's a big dry erase board ones that size at walmart are at least you know ten to twelve dollars So I got on that list. Uh, six, no. Six half inch by five leg bolt, six of them. All right, y'all, we just got back home. I got a couple of things from the little Dollar Tree Plus section. And then some stuff just from, you know, all the regular Dollar Tree stuff. From the Dollar Tree Plus section, I got this little throw blanket. It's got little bunnies all over it. It's cute. And then the kids were wanting a magnifying glass the other day. And we didn't have one. So I got all of them a little magnifying glass. Manly got something sticky on his. I even got him one because I knew he would want to play with theirs. But here's how they are. I got Jonah and Manly a blue one and Cece a purple one. Jonah got some 
Slim Jims there. Jake and Tyler though, they didn't want a magnifying glass, so I got them some Reese cups and a pack of gum. And then they had these, this was in the Dollar Tree Plus section, for $5, seven Sharpie markers. So I got a box of those. They had these cake pans for $5, right? Yeah, $5, so I got one of those. I got this little embroidery kit. I think that is so cute. Meet me at the carrot patch. And then this was just with the regular Dollar Tree stuff, so it was $1.25. I thought it was really pretty. They have lots of really cute Easter stuff. Got this little pack of plates. It says, Welcome Spring. I got these little mini spatulas. They are adorable. One has a bunny, and you can't really tell on here, but it's a white and pink checkered bunny, and then an egg that says Egg Hunt. And I think that's all I got from the Dollar Tree. I got this from Lowe's. This smells so good. I was also gonna run into Big Lots just to look at their spring stuff, but we needed to hurry and get back because we were burning daylight. We have one and a half pizzas left over plus chicken from last night. So that's what's for supper tonight. And I really like this New York style. This is the, I'm trying to see on here if it said what it was called. I'm pretty sure it's called New York style pepperoni. It is really good. Are we feeding the chickens? He walked out here saying we're feeding the chickens. Somebody left some sticks. Yeah. Almost done, Manny. You have been working hard on this? I work hard, Daddy. Yeah. Look, he has the bubbles. He's been working hard on this, Daddy. Okay. <laughs> I found another one. 